Hi, I'm Shelly Wood and this is my tiny sewing room where I make doll clothes sewing videos. Today I'm going to show you how to sew this dress which will fit Skipper and similar sized dolls. Mine uses Easter themed cotton fabric with a felt bodice, but you could use any cotton fabric for the skirt. Before we begin, please go to ShellyWood.com to download and print this free PDF sewing pattern. You only need these two sections of your pattern. Use the pattern to cut out all the pieces shown here. Sew darts in the bodice, like you see me doing here. Sew the back to the front along the shoulder, just like that. Do this with both back pieces. Press the seams flat with an iron. If children are doing this, they need adult supervision. Fold the backs down against the front and stitch the side seams. Just like this. Invert the bodice. Let's put the bodice aside for a moment. Now we can work with the skirt for a little bit. Hem one side of the skirt using a double fold or rolled hem. See the description below for help with hemming. Flip the skirt over and gather the other side. There's a link in the description below this video for my tutorial on gathering. When you gather your skirt, be sure and leave the edge ungathered about a centimeter on each side. Pin the bodice's base to the gathers I like to use a back stitch to attach my skirting and if you'd like help learning how to do a back stitch, I have a video for that too. Just look in the description. Stitch all the way around the skirt at that gathering area, but avoid stitching the edges that haven't been gathered. So there will be a slight overhanging of fab fabric and you want that. Use a double fold hem on these skirt sides, but only hem about halfway down the skirt. The sides of the skirt will look like this. Now fold the skirt in half and pin it where it's not hemmed. Sew that pinned area. Invert the whole dress. Sew a few snaps down the back and again if you need help sewing snaps on fabric I have a tutorial for that. Embellish with a pretty button in the front and now you're ready to try it on your doll. What a cute Easter dress! For more free printable sewing patterns for making doll clothes for dolls of many shapes and all different sizes, please remember to visit my website, ShellyWood.com. What if there was an easy way to take a big doll pattern and resize it to fit a little doll, or vice versa? I'm Shelly Wood, the doll clothing designer, and in my pattern alteration class, I'm going to share with you my resizing formula. Pattern alteration is when you take a pattern that you already own and you make changes to it. 
Let's say a dress doesn't fit your doll quite right. I'll show you how to create a gusset to extend the dress's bodice. Along the same lines, I'll show you how to use a doll's body measurements to lengthen and shorten shirt sleeves and to recreate the pants patterns you already own so they will fit dolls of different shapes and sizes. Following my instructions, you'll learn how to reshape dresses and skirts, making them fuller or less full depending on the look you're going for. With this collection of more than 40 videos, you'll use my measurement guide and dozens of tips and tricks to create a full wardrobe for the dollar dolls of your choice. I invite you to join me. We are going to have so much fun.